everyone. Welcome back to the show floor in Las Vegas Snowflake Summit 22 with 7,000 plus folks here. Lisa Martin with Dave Vellante. Great to be back in person. We're excited to welcome a couple of guests that join us next. Prasanna Krishnan is here, the Director of Product for Collaboration and Snowflake Marketplace. Katie Laughlin joins us as well, the Global Head Offerings Human Data Science Cloud at Customer, IQVIA. Ladies, welcome to the program. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Hey, thanks for coming on. Katie, let's go ahead and start with you. Give the audience an overview of IQVIA, what you guys do, your mission, what you deliver. Yeah, sure. So IQVIA is a healthcare focused data analytics and clinical research organization. We have 82,000 employees, we operate in 100 countries, and we have tens of thousands of data deliverables that we curate for our customers and deliver to them on a monthly basis. So um, we're 100% healthcare focused, whether it's clinical research, helping our customers support their clinical trials, real world evidence, how are our medicines operating in the market, or commercial aspects, you know, how is your company performing overall? on the market. How long have you been a customer of Snowflakes? Uh, a few years, yeah. A few years, yep. okay. Yeah. Persona, tremendous growth going on right now. There's a rocket ship. You could even feel kind of like the whiplash <laughs> from the keynote and all the announcements going on. But looking at the first quarter 23, fiscal 23 results, product revenue 384 million, 85% growth, tremendous momentum going on, big growth in customers. Talk to us about IQVIA, its partnership with Snowflake and, and the Data Driver Award program they, they just won. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I'll start with a little bit about the Snowflake collaboration capabilities, which enable these thousands of customers to really collaborate on the data cloud, uh, to be able to break down silos between data and drive business decisions based on data and applications that live outside your own four walls as well. And this is where IQVIA, as a leader in, in healthcare data, bringing together data to enable healthcare organizations to, to be more data driven um, and to really drive uh, insights, uh, won the Data for Good Award, uh, which we are really excited with the partnership and really excited to have IQVIA uh, be the winner of the award. And what does that mean, the, the Data for Good? We always love talking about that, Katie. Sure. What does that mean? How is that embodied at IQVIA? Can you say the last part? Yeah, how is that embodied at IQVIA? Uh, that's a great question. Um, I think everyone that works at IQVIA believes in the mission, which is really to drive healthcare forward. Um, we're really proud of a lot of the things that we do. So with the advent of COVID, for example, um, we really had to pivot and help our customers. How do we keep executing on clinical trials? Uh, we supported a lot of the COVID trials that came forward um, and helped our customers understand how is this affecting patients in the real world and how is it affecting your commercial operations? So being in Vegas with tens of thousands of people around and almost nobody wearing masks, I think to myself, I'm part of the organization, an organization that helped make that possible. So Frank Slootman today, Katie, talked about, he talked about one pharmaceutical compressing from nine years to seven years. You guys have mm -hmm. done a lot of, obviously, con contract research over the years. So mm -hmm. what has that Snowflake journey been like? What's been the business impact of, mm -hmm. of working yeah. with that and the yeah, collaboration? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so my focus is really around our data as a service offering, which is where we're enabling our customers to ingest their data in modern ways. So if you imagine, you know, we've done everything from paper to big tapes of data for over 60 years of, of our company being in business, now to VPN, SFTP, making multiple hops of data from one into the other. I was just learning about uh, one of our use cases where, um, we're able to cut down processing time for our customers for two weeks. So they data share some data with us, we do some additional processing on that, we serve it back to them, and we're saving them two weeks of time to gain time to insights. All right, mm -hmm. and Prasanna, uh, collaboration transcends data sharing, right? It's almost like it's, that's, that's sort of the, the first, the core of the concentric circle, right? Yeah. Talk about what else Im is embodied in collaboration. Yeah, it's a great question. So the first problem that we solved was getting access to data through our core sharing technology. And as you were talking about, Katie, replacing FTPs and having to build APIs, which were cumbersome, um, and instead being able to access data on the data cloud without having to copy or move anything. That was the core sharing technology. Mm -hmm. But that solves the first problem, which is the access problem. The second problem is how do I discover what, what's out there? How do I better understand it? How do I evaluate it? How do I try it and buy it? And those are all the problems that we're solving with the marketplace, um, which is now home to both data and applications that you can discover, try and buy. Mm -hmm. Can you talk to us about what IQVIA was doing before Snowflake? What was that life like before? How were you enabling customers to leverage data to make data-driven decisions? Yeah, so we've 
as I said, we're a data and analytics company, so we provide some native uh, analytics capabilities to our customers, but most customers, most of the large customers, I would say, are, they're building their own data lakes, they have their own ecosystem, some of them are adopting Snowflake, and we really needed to partner with them on being able to get the data to them as quickly as possible. So, like I, I was just describing a minute ago, we would have multiple hops where we deliver to a location, customer ingests it, customer does their QC, then they process it, and then it appears in their data warehouse. And now we're able to adopt their QC protocols within our own platform and deliver the data to them much more quickly. And what does that enable to your business from an outcomes perspective? If you look at overall Snowflake as an engine, what is that enabling and empowering IQVIA to accomplish? So it helps us partner with our customers in modern ways. So I'm saying we've been in the data business for 60 years. So it's sometimes it's a legacy behemoth that you need to um, bring along to modern times. And I think for us, the shift has been night and day in terms of Snowflake's capabilities. So you will build data-based apps in the Snowflake data cloud, is that is that where you're headed? Yes, yeah, so we have several applications that we built natively on Snowflake that we offer to our customers. And, and what will that bring you that you kind of couldn't do before? That we couldn't do before? Yes. I think the, pro the ability to, um, we talk a lot about how you spend 80% of your time um, cooking the data, right? Getting it ready for insights and only 20% of your time being able to to bring those insights forward. And Snowflake, it really helps us flip that ratio so that we don't have to worry so much about the scaling and the infrastructure and the data sourcing. We can focus more on driving those insights and innovations. So Persona, we talk a lot about you have this application stack over here and there's a database over here and then you have an analytics stack. It seems like you're enabling those worlds to come together. Is that is that by design? Is that more organic? Can you talk about that? Yeah, I mean that is central to our, our mission and our value prop is to bring it together. It's one product, it's seamless, and lets you do more with your data. Uh, Benwa talked today in the key opening keynote about running multiple workloads on your data, and the way you do that is by having one product that allows you to, to run your data, data queries, but also build applications that can run against that data. Katie, can you share a little bit about the partnership, uh, we'll say collaboration, mm -hmm. that IQVIA has with Snowflake in terms of your ability to influence the roadmap in the direction? We heard a lot of customer stories in the keynote and they talked a lot about, Frank Slootman did, Benoit, Christian, we're listening to our customers. Do you feel that as a, a customer for the last few years? Yeah, absolutely. So we have a really broad partnership with Snowflake. We're a customer. Uh, we have OEM licensing where we're building applications on top of Snowflake. We're um, an SI partner where we're marrying our data healthcare expertise along with Snowflake technology expertise and helping customers build and, and utilize the data internally. And as well as just, uh, if nothing else, uh, the Snowflake data share in order to deliver the data into their environment. Prasanna, what do you look for in a data driver winner? Like what stood out about IQVIA and others that aspire to that? What should they yeah. be focused on? Yeah, I mean, you know, we ultimately think that in every business, you have business needs that you are trying to solve, and business is inherently collaborative. You never solve problems with just what you have within your own four walls. And IQVIA is an example of, a, of someone that's really enabling outcomes for healthcare companies to be much faster through live access to data, um, which is what we want to accomplish with the data cloud, help our, company, help our customers solve business needs. Yeah. Every company has to be a data company these days, right? There's no, <laughs> you have no choice. We talked about you know, software eating the world a few years ago, now we're talking about data eating the world. For organizations, it's in any, any vertical, healthcare, life sciences, retail, finance, it's in, essential to not just have data, live data, access to it, to be able to extract insights from it that you can act on. Talk about what you're doing at Snowflake as, as a differentiator, as that goal of becoming the de facto standard data platform, and what that enables partners like IQVIA to accomplish. Yeah, it starts with our fundamental architecture, which allows you to collaborate and access data without creating copies of it or sending around copies. And built on top of that now, the ability to build applications and to monetize them uh, really enables our customers to do more with their data and to monetize it and to be able to distribute it without having to deal with all the plumbing. That's nice, that saves you a lot of time. What do you think, when you, Kitty, if you talk to people that are your peers in either healthcare or other industries, what are like the top couple of recommendations that you would have for them mm -hmm. if they go, we have a data problem, it's all a data problem. How do we actually leverage value from this fast so we can be competitive? 
Yeah. So I think if I were to advise someone who is thinking about commercializing their data set when if they haven't before, you know, you have to think about good data governance protocols, good data cataloging, um, make sure you're you know, conforming to all of the privacy rules that you need to and, and um, overseeing the management of that data, any changes in the data, you know, delivering that both to internal and external customers. But I think um, just a quick plug for Snowflake, what I would say um, on a personal level is that their partner uh, first mentality really um, is a pleasure, makes it a pleasure to work with them um, and makes it really easy for us to enable our uh, services through, through Snowflake. Frank Slootman talked about mission alignment this morning, kind of a mission I thought of, of aligning on, with the missions of their customers and partners. It sounds like that's what Katie's talking about from a cultural perspective. You've got that alignment here? Yes, absolutely. You know, we work with our partners to enable our customers to drive business value and, and solve the needs of their industry. What are some of the things that you are excited about? Fourth annual summit, we, I, I said 7,000 plus people, we'll get numbers kind of later on. What are you excited about finally being back in person? Yes, of course. Being able to access this hugely growing population of customers and partners. What excites you about this Summit 22? What excites me most is the fact that we are now enabling our customers to do more, to build applications, which has been a big theme at Summit, but also to be able to distribute and monetize this. Um, so as Frank talked about this morning, helping customers drive value and more value from, from their data. Critical. Katie, last question for you. If we look at all the, it was a very technical keynote this morning. You talked about the great partnership, the synergies, the alignment that IQVIA has with Snowflake. What are you excited about in terms of hearing and seeing and feeling and touching this week at Summit? Well, uh Yesterday we won an award for uh, Data Marketplace, uh, uh, Marketplace Partner of the Year for Healthcare and Life Sciences. That was really exciting for us. It was great recognition for us in terms of how we've been able to modernize on the cloud. Um, but I'm really excited to see how much the Snowflake uh, business has grown as well. Our general manager for information management was telling me that when I come to this conference a couple of years ago, it was only a few thousand people. Now it's really, it's really grown and really taken off. And it's really exciting to see how many of the different partnerships are interacting and, and that we're able to take advantage of as well. Yeah, I think we heard earlier this morning that the first summit four years ago was a couple thousand people. Now who we are, eight, eight to 10. We've also seen, Prasan, I mentioned some of the product revenue numbers for fiscal 23Q1. I also noticed that in the last four years, the number, percentage of customers with a million plus ARR is grown over 1,200%. The number of customers is growing, the, the high value customers are growing. It seems like you're on a rocket ship here with Snowflake. Would you agree? Yeah, we're excited with all the value that we're bringing to our customers and the growth we're seeing. Yeah, way to amp it up. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent, ladies. Thank you so much for joining us, talking about the partnership with IQVIA and Snowflake. Congratulations again. Thank you. Katie on IQVIA winning the Data Driver Award. Yeah, Data for we're Good. Excited. Great to hear what you're doing together and how you're enabling organizations in the healthcare industry to maximize the value of data. We appreciate your insights. Thank, Thank you. you guys. Thanks. Thank for you. our guests and Dave Vellante, I'm Lisa Martin. You're watching theCUBE's live coverage from Las Vegas of Snowflake Summit 22. Stick around, Dave and I will be right back with our next guest.